Minister of Finance Winston Jordan has been busy meeting with stakeholders as budget 2019 preparations continue to move apace. He discussed the sensitive issue of taxes with the private sector. The minister and his budget team met with executives of the Guyana Gold and Diamond Miners Association and the Georgetown Chambers of Commerce and Industry, respectively. The familiar game is there where uh, requests are being made for significant concessions in a number of areas. Um, but I keep stressing that if we were, if we give concessions, what are we getting in return um, for them? Um, that is still an open book um, question. But we promise them we will take all of their suggestions, um, recommendations um, in the context of the Budget 2019, and to the extent that we can um, fulfill uh, them, we will, whether partially or whole. Minister Jordan reminded that all concessions should be tied to performance. We don't just give concessions which are uh, reliefs in certain areas, but an expense to the average um, citizen. We don't just give it um, because of that. We expect a benefit uh, down the road so that in the case of the gold sector, uh, the concessions that we um, have given, we expect they will result in improved mining practices, uh, improved declarations, you know, and hence improved foreign currency to the Bank of Guyana and, uh, taxation and taxes for the government. The day's consultation started with presentations by GGDMA's Chairman Terence Adams. Adams noted that of priority was the need to add the wording of final tax in the 2018 budget with regards to minors, which he said is causing great uncertainty within the sector. The removal of value-added taxes on excavators and all terrain vehicles, once certain levels of gold and diamond production declarations are achieved, was discussed. The GC and CI's consultations followed with executives making cases for tax relief in several sectors. These included the need for more farm-to-market roads in Regions 3 and 5, tax relief on pesticides, passage of e-commerce legislation, tax reform, local content legislation's passage, and modernized financial services legislation. Budget 2019 consultations continue today at the Finance Ministry's boardroom from 2 p.m. Check our website, www.dpi.gov.gy, for further details. Crystal Stahl for InfoHub.